gear up for an epic showdown as Transformers Rise of the Beast roars onto the big screen. Join us as we delve into the action-packed sequel to Bumblebee and explore new factions, formidable threats, and Earth's fate hanging in the balance. Get ready for an adrenaline-fueled adventure that will leave you on the edge of your seat. Transformers Rise of the Beast is an exciting and action-packed sequel to the film Bumblebee. This installment introduces new factions of robots and presents a new threat to Earth. The movie follows the story of Noah, portrayed by Anthony Ramos, a former soldier and electronics expert, and Alina, played by Dominique Fishback, a museum intern and artifact researcher. Together, they find themselves caught in the midst of a war between the Autobots. can look forward to intense action sequences, breathtaking special effects, and a gripping narrative in Transformers Rise of the Beast, which explores the conflict between various robot factions and their struggle to defend Earth from the looming threat. With a blend of sci-fi adventure and titanic robot fights, this film carries on the legacy of the Transformers series. Optimus Prime and Bumblebee shine bright in this one. In fact, Bumblebee gets to utter a phrase that is in my top tier of best movie lines ever spoken. I thought I wasn't hearing it correctly, but he really said right before he deactivates, Oh Captain, my Captain. His rebirth and return to the battlefield was a major highlight of the film, but nothing tops Optimus Prime ripping Scourge's head off and arrival to Earth playing as they escape. That was a little something for the people who had to suffer through the absolute garbage that was most of the Transformers franchise, but still love parts of it. New beginnings. Stephen Capel Jr. As direction is strong overall, the fights can get a little chaotic, but a second act chase and third act final battle are still a lot of fun. The music by John Nick Bontemps wisely chooses to lay off the nostalgia for the most part, creating its own epic score and using classic pieces sparingly. The soundtrack does a good job making it easy to adjust to the time jump and making it feel authentic and the CG is impressive overall. There's obviously a few weak spots throughout, but it still maintains that balance between realistic details and more animated flourishes. Transformers is all about its CGI, action pieces, and the emotions between the Autobots and humans. And this movie has done that perfectly well. I would say it's not great as Michael Bay first Transformers movie, but it's not that bad at all. Action and CGI is terrific in this film. Especially the beast that has shown in the film was executed perfectly well. There is a scope for the sequels as director has given many hints in the end. Let's see what they have in store for us in near future. All in all, if you have watched previous Transformers films, watch this film, you won't be disappointed and especially the action sequences are amazing.